the Porsche 911. After 51 legendary years in production, the Porsche 911 is considered to be one of the greatest sports cars in the world. But to paraphrase the old cliché, Porsche took a bad idea and refined it to brilliance. Not only is the 911's engine in the back of the car, it's so far behind the rear axle that even the slightest miscalculation can cause dangerous oversteer, sending you hurtling backwards into oncoming traffic. Porsche engineers first tried to solve the car's weight imbalance by putting iron weights in the front bumpers of early cars. By the early 70s, the 911's iconic whale tail spoiler and front air dam did wonders to keep the car planted to the ground. Today, a fantastic all-wheel drive system and traction control have ironed out most of the modern 911's homicidal urges. But while the older cars are definitely good looking, they are undeniably dangerous as well. The Mercedes-Benz SL Series Introduced in 2001, the Mercedes SL Roadster was the epitome of a German GT car. It was powered by various V6s, several V8 engines, and a 5.5 liter V12 in the SL600 version. The car also looks great, it has the performance to match, and to top it all off, it's even well built. Well, sort of. In the SLS model, the car's go-wing doors have a 95% probability of sending you to an early grave. Safety is the biggest issue with the car's go-wing door design. In a rollover crash, getting the go-wing doors to open could be a little rough, or most likely impossible. Mercedes designed the doors on the SLS with explosive bolts that will fire the door off its hinges if the car is upside down, but no solution is quite as elegant as just not having going doors. 